So Neha, let me start with you. Hi everyone, it's just great to be here. It's probably the only place where you can, only event where it's legitimate to actually uh, yawn. And that's what I was doing. Because if you're yawning sitting over here, you can just go there and it's like the best thing ever. But I was hoping you didn't ask me that question first because I don't want to set the bar too high or too low. But it's how it's going to come. I'm just going to be honest. And I'd be, I'd be like um, a four. All right, that's pretty good. Or a three and a half, actually. All right. Less. And how do you cope up with stress? By passing out. <laughs> I'm just like, if this is so that's what we're discussing too stressful, today. or if this, stress. this is getting too hectic for me, the first thing I do is uh, try and throw my phone far away. And then that stresses me out, and then I go and look for my phone. And then when I find my phone again, it stresses me out every, even more. So, and then I'm just like, you know what? I'm going to let everything go and I'm just going to pass out. Um, there was, um, so there was this amazing film that came out just now called Wonder Woman. And uh, there's this scene, the first time she actually interacts with a guy because she's from, you know, a completely different island and they haven't really seen men or civilization. And he keeps looking for his watch and she's just like, she asks him innocent and uh, interesting question, which is so simple. And she's like, how can something gadget or something else except when we're actually passed out and sleeping, you know. That's the only relaxed or most amazing time for you. All right. My mom, what about you? What's your uh, score on a scale of 1 to 10 on stress? Today? No, in life, generally. Yeah, so for the last four years, it's been 10. <laughs> okay, you're the perfect candidate for this. Yeah. Just to give you an idea, I landed from Agra. I got ready. I did my own hair. It's difficult, okay, the men, I want to tell you, to wash it and to blow dry it and to straighten it. And then I did my makeup in the car. And uh, I was half ready. I was in my chuckles. So if you go and see the car, it has bathroom chuckles and everything. So I got ready and I have a flight to catch to America and I have not packed at 2 o'clock. So while I'm talking about how one should relax, I'm actually very stressed, so I'm 10. <laughs> uh, what de-stresses me is shopping. I was just telling her, you know, everything calls out to me, like this mattress <laughs> is telling me, buy me, buy me. <laughs> I want to buy it for my mother because she doesn't keep very well, and I think it's wonderful. Uh, I just stay worried about uh, her oxygen levels, her heart rate, her blood pressure. And right now I'm stressed out because I'm going to be away for a month. And this is, this is absolutely wonderful. This is something I want to get for her. So knowing and being in control is so much better and less stressful. Okay. So, uh, Magni, is, uh, I mean, thank you so much for getting this to India. <laughs> What is the question? Can you? Should I repeat? Yes, could you please stand up and keep it short and clear? Tell us clearly what you want to ask. The talk. question is to Neha and Mahima. Yes. What are the three things you look into whenever you become a part of any brand or associate yourself with the brand? Sorry, could you Should I repeat? repeat? Should I repeat? Yes, please. The question please. is to Neha and Mahima. Yes, yes. What are the three things they look into whenever they become a part of any brand okay. or association? Right. Uh, Neha and Mahima, that's for you. They want to know, he wants to know uh, what are the three things that you look into or assess before you get associated with a brand? I think, uh, you know, I'm sorry we made you repeat the question so many times. I think it was just no problem. facing the other way. I think the most important thing definitely is an association in the sense that do you relate to the brand and does the brand relate to you? Um, I think as far as Magniflex is concerned, it's great. We're just not talking about mattresses or it's not it's not something to do with home decor, but it's got everything to do with lifestyle, it's got everything to do with health, with fitness. So yeah, I see as far as I'm concerned, I wouldn't be able to speak for anyone else. There's a huge amount of relatability. Secondly, most importantly, would you use this brand even if you weren't on stage talking about it? or far away somewhere or in a poster endorsing it? The answer to that should always be a yes. I would definitely use the brand. I would definitely use Magniflex 
once I knew about it, once I study about it, that's the second thing. And thirdly, are you selling people the right pitch? Are you talking about quality? Are you giving them what the brand is giving? And are you delivering as much as they say they are? Because, you know, at the end of the day... Being, being a judge on so many reality shows where the kids are involved, what's your take on that? Look, can you, I didn't understand the, the first part of the tweet. If he says, humble request to all the authorities to urgently, to urgently ban all reality show involving children. Reality it's shows actually, involving children. Yes. It's actually destroying them emotionally and their purity. I think, you know, it's different. It's, uh, it's a bit of a competitive world and I have to um, stand up for everything that I endorse. I have been a judge on a kids comedy show. And uh, the most important thing is that it, one is we know as authorities what happens. Maybe sometimes it's an overkill and I respect what is said in the tweet, but more importantly, you know, there is a flip side to it, what Sujit is talking about. The other side is the fact that these kids are looked after, they're sent to school, they get, um, you know, for that two weeks or three weeks that they're in a part of um, a certain program when they're on TV, they get tutored by their teachers in uh, their own private environment. And secondly, I feel like it gives them confidence, it gives them a stage to perform, and it gives them direction, maybe 10 years too early in life. But hey, if somebody at the, at the age of nine or at, at the age of 12 realizes that they want to become an actor, there's no harm if there is a platform or a stage provided to them by really big GEC channels. But yes, at the same time, I'm a firm believer in education. And whatever your dream is, you make sure you complete your education and then take it forward. Mahima, what's your take on this? Okay, that's, that should be the last question because I think we're running out of time. I've been getting... Okay. okay, that'll be the last. Seriously, this is the last one. Okay, one quick. Answer. I don't know about the industry where they've tried to keep the regional films out, is what I saw. But me personally, for me, the tax has just gone up. So I don't know who's going to be happy about paying more taxes. I'm not. 15% service tax was good enough for me. Now it's 18%. So I don't know how the industry is going to be. Uh, the regional firms are exempted, but it's definitely more taxes for me. Great. Just mattress पे सोते हैं, तो आपके लिए आपकी नींद के लिए कितना मतलब contribution होता है उसका मतलब अगर बहुत बढ़िया mattress है आपको इतनी अच्छी नींद आएगी और जब आप उठेंगे तो आपके body में वो aches और pains नहीं होंगे. And अभी मैं थोड़ी देर पहले यही बात कर रही थी कि बहुत बार जब हम लोग बहुत खूबसूरत से hotel में जाते हैं, तो वहाँ के जब bed पे सोते हैं तो बहुत कमाल की नींद आती है। तो that is because उनकी जो bedings होते हैं, mattresses होते हैं, pillows होते हैं, वो बहुत high quality के होते हैं। तो यहाँ पे भी जो launch हो रहे हैं mattress, वो यही समझाने के लिए कि आपको अच्छी नींद चाहिए और फिर आपको कोई अगर issues हैं जैसे back problem है, तो उसके लिए कौन सा mattress? सब के लिए अलग-अलग type का mattress की जरूरत होती है। तो वो सब इनके पास हैं। and ये ही awareness create करने के लिए हमने ये event किया है उसपे discussion होगा कि लोग इतने stressed क्यों रहते हैं और मेरे ख्याल से mattress में invest करना बहुत महत्वपूर्ण है because लोग कहते हैं कि आपकी आधी ज़िंदगी आप सोते हुए गुजारते हैं तो उसमें investment करना I think is is very very important for health for good sleep we invest so much in buying a car but I think जिसपे आप इतना समय बिताते हैं सिर्फ सोने के लिए नहीं आजकल तो लोग बैठ के लैपटॉप पे काम करते हैं बिस्तर पे टेलीविजन इतने घंटों देखते हैं बेड पे से सो आई थिंक इट्स इट्स इट मेक्स फॉर अ वेरी वेरी इंटेलिजेंट इन्वेस्टमेंट कि आप एक बहुत बढ़िया गुड क्वालिटी मैट्रेस जरूर अपने मतलब घर में लाएं एंड it's also, I think, a very beautiful uh, item to gift somebody Personally, so that they get a good night's sleep always. I personally stress leave. How do I do it? It depends on the physical stress or the emotional location shoot. I like to sleep a lot. I just like my sleep. So I sleep a lot if I get time. Thank you so much. I think the most stress is on my mobile phone. You know, suddenly when you think everything is going fine and you suddenly check a message and you're like, 
ये या हुआ नहीं या फिर ये करना है और दिस पर्सन इज नॉट गेटिंग इन टच आई फील लाइक वन थिंग दैट आई डू स्टे अवे फ्रॉम माय मोबाइल फोन क्योंकि जब भी मैं छुट्टी की भी बात करती हूँ मैं हमेशा ये बोलती हूँ कि मुझे कोई ऐसी जगह पे जाना है जहाँ पे मैं बहुत ज़्यादा सो सकूँ और जहाँ मेरा फ़ोन ना काम करे सो आई थिंक द टू थिंग्स दर आई डू टू रिलीव स्ट्रेस वन इज गेट रेड माई फोन द अदर वन इज स्लीप रियली वेल You know, I have to be honest. I have not used the Magni Smart Tech, but I've used Magniflex mattresses. Or, because I'm a, you know, I've I've been a customer, consumer, whatever you'd like to call me, and it has a technology where you feel better. Uh, काफी लोगों को यहाँ पे शायद पता नहीं होता पर हम जब लड़कियाँ अब इतनी हाई हील्स पहन के घूमती हैं तो बाय द एंड ऑफ द डे यू नो आई फीट आल्सो स्वेल अप एंड वे लाइक देर वाज अ टाइम आई यूज टू कीप पिलोज अंडरनीथ माय फीट एंड स्लीप बट नाउ मैग्नीफ्लेक्स हैज द टेक्नोलॉजी इट नोज वॉट आर्च वॉट बॉडी फॉर्म आई यूज द मोस्ट बेसिक मैट्रेस बट आई एम टेलिंग यू इफ यू यूज द राइट मैट्रेस Your sleep changes. It really does. Okay, yeah. What's your fitness mantra? I mean, if I talk about it, you know, you are always active. You are always active. Whether it's industry, talk about it, or web series, or anything, you are always active. Yeah, industry. Yeah, industry. What is your What is your fitness mantra? वैसे मैंने कोई वेब सीरीज अभी तक की नहीं पर अगर आपने देखा है मुझे किसी वेब सीरीज में तो वो अलग बात है पर माई फिटनेस मंड इज़ वेरी सिंपल या एज सुन एज आई गेट अप ऐसा नहीं है कि सुबह सात बजे उठ के एक्सरसाइज करनी है पर इफ माई वर्क स्टार्ट एट वन ओ क्लॉक इन दी आफ्टरनून देन आई डू अ माइनस थ्री आवर्स आई गेट अप आई गो वर्क आउट एंड देन आई स्टार्ट माई वर्क अगर मेरा काम नौ बजे से शुरू हो रहा है तो मेरा दिन छः बजे शुरू होता है सो एवरी डे लाइक इवन द डॉक्टर सेट एक घंटा मैं जरूर एक्सरसाइज करती हूँ मिनिमम समटाइम्स आई इवन डू टू वर्कआउट एंड इज गॉट नथिंग टू डू विद क्योंकि आप इंडस्ट्री में हैं इवन वेन आई डेंट थिंक दैट कि मैं एक्टर बनूंगी आई वॉज ऑलवेज इन टू स्पोर्ट्स आई वॉज ऑलवेज इन टू एथलेटिक्स आई थिंक एक फौजी होने के नाते लाइफ स्टाइल भी अलग होती है सो वेट वे वी ग्रो अप डिफरेंटली बट येस फिटनेस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इट्स वेरी स्केरी नॉट टू बी फिट नो आई थिंक वर्किंग आवर्स से ज्यादा यू नो इट्स योर एबिलिटी टू से नो आई डोंट आई डोंट आई डेंट थिंक आई हैड दैट बट नाउ आई बिकम अ लिटल मोर सेल्फिश कि यहाँ जाना है वहाँ जाना है इफ इट कम्स इन द वे ऑफ माई स्लीप और इफ अन अदर कमिटमेंट और इफ इट्स नॉट वर्क कि मतलब शूट के अलावा कहीं और जाना है and if i know that i'm going to lose my sleep over it i don't i definitely choose a good night's rest kyunki agar agle din shoot ho to i don't go out at all but yeah if i know that theek hai agle din late uth sakte then maybe i do step up okay 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 tell me is shuru hai the tumhari tumhari shuru shuru the tribute to shri devi we can throw some more light on that i don't think i can throw any light on that just yet all i can say is the film comes out on the 1st of december and it's been amazing working with vidya and uh, rest once the promo is out thank you